Hello, this is Virpi Tervonen of Integrate Returns and in this video I will show you how to create PayPal payment buttons for your websites and blogs. After you have logged in into your account, you have to navigate to Merchants Services tab up here. And when you reach this page, you scroll down until you see this Learn More button next to the Payment Buttons row. When you click the orange button, you reach this page and here you can choose what type of payment buttons you can create and uh, this time we are choosing a single item payment, payment button and uh, we continue by clicking the create one now link on the page that opens you are given three steps to complete basically number one and three are those that you need to pay attention to we um, leave this by uh, for default. You can choose this, uh, subscriptions. That means that you can create recurring payments, for example, for membership sites that you want to charge people on monthly basis or a shopping cart. But we use this for the single item payment button that we are creating now. Item name. You need to fill in something uh, that the client knows what she or he is buying and uh, this is important to be the same that you are selling on your website on your sales letter or in your sales video the item ID it is optional but um, for your own documentation it's good to have a running number for your item so that you know what are you selling and what is the current price here on the price you fill in the price in numbers and the currency here you can choose from different currencies and especially if you're selling to local market instead of global market you can choose your local currency here but uh, in my case because I'm selling to the, lo the global um, clientele I'm using US dollars here the next one is about customizing your button so this is the default payment button that um, is okay to use but in this case what I want to do is use my own so this is by default this is just fine to use if you don't have your own image don't worry this is good I just show this is an advanced step here to create a customized appearance and this is totally optional what I want to use is use my own button image and when I click the radio button it, PayPal asks me the exact URL of the image where I have uploaded or where I store the image I want to use as the button so I copy paste this image URL here right now after I have uh, the URL the exact URI of my images location in the internet I am done with that and actually basically I will show you shortly the step one uh, this by default saves your buttons at Bay PayPal so that you can edit them later especially if you're changing for example the the price of your item you can you can edit the existing buttons instead of uh, creating a new one so basically number two is something that you never have to do any um, changes or edit that so we go to number three and here is something that is very important especially delivering the, a digital product like I am so my course is a digital product that is delivered over the internet so I after my clients have uh, my customers have made the payment I want them to get and see a membership site and registration page where they can uh, register for the course after they have made the payment and this is very important because when you make a payment you definitely want to know that you get your your purchase the item that you just paid for so if you have a digital digitally delivered item here's where you put the URL where they can get more information on how they are going to get the item and also if you have physical products or courses that you deliver live it's good to have a URL a page a web page where you tell more about when and how they are going to get the item 
and also a customer service uh, email and phone number just in case that they are panicking whether and how they're going to get the item that they just paid for. So here I filled in a, a URL where they are di redirected after they have made the payment within PayPal. And basically that's it. The last thing is to click the create button at the bottom of this page and on the next page you will get the code that when this is copy pasted on your sales page in the HTML code, in the source code, it will appear as a functional payment button. The other option is to click here for the email and just simply have a link which you can give to people so that they can make the payment after they visit this link. Here's how easy and quick it is to create PayPal buttons and get a link for email. You can use all this also on your website as well or get the source code uh, that you copy paste into your HTML code of your web page where you have the sales letter or sales video for your item. And as always when you create something always test that the link is functional. So what I do is that I copy this link and uh, then I go to internet browser and paste it to the address bar and uh, visit this link to see that everything looks to be fine. And as you can see here this is the item name that I just gave when I was creating the payment button and the link webinars that sell item number is here, the price is here, everything looks just fine, it shows that it's a uh, USD and here when I log in it's good that you actually test this with this your own PayPal account that you log in, you make a payment, you can actually set this uh, for one dollar while testing and before releasing the payment button or the live link anywhere that you set this for one dollar and then test by uh, making the payment by yourself so that you will see that you will be direct to the to the correct download page or instructional page after the payment and uh, after everything uh, you have tested that it works then you can go and edit the button and then put the correct price there just in case that you're wondering where you will find your already existing payment buttons you go back to merchant services you go to your payment buttons again you go to uh, create one now and here you, you click this link go to my saved buttons to edit the, any of the buttons you have there so that you can make changes to the price or the name of the item or any any other or like the download page if you want to change that you can edit all that here when you go to this link so I hope this was helpful for you and you will realize how easy and quick it is to create PayPal buttons and uh, collect payments online. So this is Virpiteravonen of integratereturns.com. Thank you for watching this video.